5.30, we'll call the meeting to order. Start with roll call. Alderperson Salazar. Here. Alderperson Ramey. Here. Alderperson Heidemann is excused. Alderperson Rust is excused. And uh, we'll start out with the Pledge of Allegiance. I pledge allegiance to the flag of the United States, States of America and to the republic for which it stands, one nation, nation Indivisible, with liberty and justice for all. Okay. I think we can skip introductions of everyone. Uh, we'll go with the uh, approval of minutes from September 12th. Uh, motion to approve. I second. Wait a second. <laughs> Any discussion on those minutes? All in favor? Aye. aye. <laughs> Chair votes aye. Those are approved. Okay, number six. Uh, resolution number 60-23-24, September 18th, 2023, a resolution authorizing the purchasing agent to issue purchase orders for the purchase of 717 trees to be received and planted in the spring of 2024 by the Department of Public Works, Parks, and Forestry Division. And I guess this would go to Tim. Okay, yes. So, this is something we've been doing for what well, we did last year as well, and we've kind of learned over the last several years. We, we want to plant trees. We want to plant as many trees as possible. We want the best diversity of trees or availability of trees. So what we learned was it's best to order or trees as early as possible. So we're, we, we put this bid out for next year's trees, right? So next spring, we're, these trees are going to show up. And we did, like I said, we did this last year, but it allows us to kind of get first dibs at some of these species that are really hard to get. Otherwise, they're, they're, they get taken fairly soon. So... That's what we did again this year. We put the bid out. The bid was out for, we were trying to get like 750 trees, but where the numbers came in, we, the budget dollars, we're looking at 67,538. That's the budget we had. So we, we got as many trees as we could. So it ended up at 17, uh, 717 trees. So the price of trees have gone up? Uh, well, we were buying more trees than we originally budgeted for. Oh, yeah. We, we budgeted for 600 mm -hmm. last year. Last year we put the, the budget dollars together, but we had some grant dollars that helped mm -hmm. increase that budget. So then we're like, hey, let's try to get 750 because we thought maybe we could do it, but um, so we fell a little short. But okay. we're still over what we what we originally wanted to. But but really, we planted 600 trees last year, and we handled it quite well. So then we learned learning from that. We're like, yeah, we could do a few more. So. Um, our big goal last year was to. <laughs> well, our goal last year was to plant more than we removed, and then we had that big storm in June, which messed mm -hmm. that up for us. Yeah. So we wanted to play it safe with planting even more. Okay. So uh, this is what's going on. It's it's uh, it's actually this year's budget dollars. That basically, we'll make a PO this year, and we won't need to. We won't get charged until the trees are delivered, and and then we'll, we'll spend that next year so which is what we did last year as well so next year's budget we'll, we'll plan to do the same thing at this about this time of year i can't get that bid out until like the end of august that's when the nurseries are like kind of aware of what they're going to have the following spring so that's what we're doing <laughs> what's the capacity of the yard back there the we have 700 we ordered 700 50 trees this we got 750 this spring because we had some extra grant dollar stuff uh -huh. um and that was some of them we plant right away in the spring now we okay. i would say we had them all in there it was pretty full mm -hmm. but after we planted 300 in the spring now there's 450 out there mm -hmm. and it's not full it's okay. it's probably three quarters full 75 okay. percent um so that way, I think it, I think that would mean the capacity is somewhere around 600. Okay. If you're going to keep them all fall, what we do is we we stage 300 in the spring in there in that like quarter that's open now, and then the other three quarters are filled up with the gravel and the, and the hoses and the, the trees that are there now. So could we put more trees in? More would fit, but we'd have to put the spring one somewhere else. Okay. And, and then it would be a little bit. Um, we'd have be more work to do in the in the fall. We're we're looking at planting around 400. This actually next week we're going to start, um, and that's going to be a pretty pretty big project. You know, that's going to take a lot of time and a lot of effort for those 400 trees. So, okay. 
and they'll make it through the winter? Uh, well, we're going to plant the trees this fall. We're plant them. Yeah, they're, they've been in our gravel bed okay. since <clears throat> spring. The roots have developed and gotten much better. Now we're planting them in the fall, which is an ideal time to plant um, because of the, you got the, 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 they don't really need much water now. We'll water them when we plant them. We'll tell homeowners to continue watering until the leaves fall off, which will be shortly. And then the benefit is they sit all winter, they're fine, they go dormant. And then in the spring, we get that spring moisture, the, the snow melts, spring moisture, and those trees benefit from, the, from having that moisture instead of planting them in the spring and then just right away, you know, the summer heat comes and then they're mm. they're hit right away. Yeah, so makes sense. It's, it's actually probably preferred to plant them in the fall than it is the spring, but by doing both is what we're doing, we can plant more trees. We wouldn't want to plant 700 right now because then it would it would take us along, you know, the whole month of October and we wouldn't be able to do anything else. Okay. All right. Any other questions? Okay. Let's look at promotion then. I'll make a motion to approve. I'll second it. Move is made and seconded. Any other discussion? All in favor? Aye. Any opposed? Chair votes aye. That's approved. Okay. Uh, next meeting date is October 10th, 2023. And I guess we're looking for a motion to adjourn. Make a motion to adjourn. I'll second that. Buddy. All in favor? Aye. Aye. We are adjourned. Thank you very much. Great. Thank you. <laughs>